Local banks have informed their staff about a looming job cut as they brace for smaller returns this year. Two local banks have already informed some staff they will either outsource or lay them off, according to a letter sent to the staff and seen by three business. This has resulted in agitations between management of the banks and staff unions, with their parents' national unions invited to intervene. Also in the insurance industry, one of Ghana's leading and biggest insurers has informed its contract and some permanent staff about the termination of their appointments next month as the company looks to cut operating expenses. It appears the domestic debt exchange will shrink income of financial service providers in many core business lines, and that is making boards of banks and insurance companies nervous about their survival in 2023. Already, the government has projected the economy to go much lower at 2.8%, one of its lowest in decades aside the COVID-induced growth of 2020. Banks are therefore bracing for smaller returns in 2023, as government assets, which are their biggest source of interest in income will yield zero returns this year. A senior executive at one of the banks who spoke to three business on anonymity said the banks have no choice than to pull staff in certain areas and exercise caution with their financial resources amid mounting economic uncertainty. For now, the Industrial and Commercial Union is expected to negotiate with some of the banks on how the retrenchment exercise could be conducted with minimal impact on labor.